My name is Jose. I sing and play guitar and partner. My n name's Lucy. I sing and play guitar and partner. And we're partner. partner. We met each other at university. In Meal Hall. In the Meal Hall. And then we played together a lot and eventually moved in together and started writing these partner songs mm -hmm. in the summer of 2014. Yep, um, that one's mostly mostly my song. Um, when I was uh, working at cafes, um, people um, would say that I talk like Ellen Page or that I look like Ellen Page, and then um, I decided to, that I would write a song about that. It was the first song that I wrote, really, like about like um, my own experiences. Um, so it it was like my first t taste of like cr creativity and like creative liberation so um uh yeah that was that <laughs> we were super pumped when ellen page came out yeah we, we were, were super like, pumped we were like hanging out and we saw the video and we're like what the fuck and like we were really pumped <laughs> yeah uh so okay our songwriting process so we usually just are struck with an idea and then um, out of nowhere. Out of nowhere, and then we just kind of sing it out for a bit. Like, right? yeah, we y yell and scream. We yell and scream and sing, and <laughs> um, and then it kind of usually takes the shape, and then we figure it out on guitar and mm -hmm. make all the decisions of what should happen in the song. Melody what we first. Say. Yeah, melody start first. with an idea lyrics and, a and melody. melody. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. um, with great power comes great responsibility. <laughs> Yep. So it feels like we have to be very responsible. Mm -hmm. And, um, yeah, um, feels um, uh, pretty unreal, like, yeah. literally. Because, like, I didn't notice. <laughs> me, me, but, like, that's, the, yeah, your answer was way better. <laughs> Yeah, it was awesome. It was a blast. Yeah, it was really awesome. Um, someone told me a gross secret in my ear. Um, I took off all my clothes, pretty much. <laughs> I was into my underwear. Yeah. Um, um, my girlfriend brought me flowers. That was really cute. My Her parents were came. there. Yeah. Um, what else? Yeah, it was just a freaking blast, oh man. Yeah. There were like a billion different inspirations. We probably don't even remember them all. We're inspired by like a lot of different stuff every day. Mm -hmm. it change, it, like we add, we add new things to our inspiration list every day. Mm -hmm. And we wrote the album over the course of like a year and a half. So we were inspired by a ton of shit in that, amount of t in that time. Mm -hmm. um, but like, yeah, broadly we're inspired by like um, self-expression, um, lesbianism <laughs> uh what else like tons of shit <laughs> personality stuff yeah um uh, psychology psychology <laughs> um the universe um rock <laughs> rock <laughs> yeah. yeah that's just a short <laughs> taste that's short taste Yeah, so the skits are a way of us further inviting the listener into our our world, um, and they just kind of help uh, help you feel like you're hanging out with us, kind of. And plus, they're we thought they were really funny, so that's why we include them. And they're completely real. Yeah, they're off the cuff. They're not acted out. Yeah, they're pranks, but like they're they're real. Except the ones with my dad. Um, those are just just him talking. Because hmm. I think you sent me a text and you're like, I just listened to all the songs in a row and it was like a whole Ooh, lot or something. Way too much. Yeah. So then we're like, well, shit, skits. And we didn't really think that much of it. And everyone's like, people don't do skits anymore and stuff. I'm like, I don't think we really noticed that we that much. Notice. We, we didn't know skits were out. We just didn't turn back once we thought of it. Like, we didn't really know rock was out that much for a while. We didn't know skits were out. No, we just yeah. did our thing. <laughs> um, but yeah, people are divided on the skits, but we stand by them. We're proud of them. Well, for one thing, I would say Sappy Fest is like a giant contribution of why like we're doing well in a way. Like, they always 
gave us a chance and stuff. Before we were big at all, they let us play there, and then a lot of people kind of found out about us from that show, and that was a big boost. But also, just like we've been going to Sappy for years and years and years, and it's like hard to describe. Yeah, like everyone that goes is like transformed, like it's after. It's, yeah. It's quite something. It's really special, and um, it would happen every year, like that we were going to school, like at, in university in Sackville, and it was kind of like witnessing that as like. A young person was like pretty like yeah pretty wild yeah and at first it was just like we'd go watch bands and party and then a couple of years in we got to play and then yeah. it was like a dream come true mm-hmm. at and then the, the time dreams just kept coming true. coming true yeah <laughs> it was awesome and the shows were really fun yeah i feel like that was a time that we really got to know toronto and it was a really lucky break, and um, it felt awesome to play the same venue like three nights in a row. It felt like may- maybe Metallica might be. Yeah, like, and the sound was great. Shout out to Vlad. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, just a blast. There were great crowds. Yeah, met a lot of people um, yeah. that time. And, like, to this to this day, it's still, like... And even to this very day, we still know some of those people. And <laughs> our manager first saw us at that show. Yeah, One so, of like, some... Great, cool, and awesome connections were made. It's a great experience. <laughs> yeah. Me and my friend Katie uh, were obsessed with it in grade seven, and um, I just thought that, like, if you think something's good as a child, that, <laughs> I don't know about that rule. <laughs> yeah, I might contest yeah. that rule. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. But that instance, it worked out. <laughs> yeah. Um, not as a there should not as a rule, but like. <laughs> Um, like, yeah, yeah, and, yeah. <laughs> I, like, if we'd watched, like, not another teen movie or something, I don't know if it would have helped. Oh, I didn't think guy. that was, like, I was nah. not obsessed with not another teen movie. I was. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought mean, that movie was sick. Yeah. <laughs> I used to rent it a lot. <laughs> As a child. At the time. At the time. Um, we're going on tour with Shamir in December, which is going to be really awesome. Yeah, that's our next big thing that we're super pumped about. Mm-hmm. Um, we hope we become best friends. So. Yeah, we want to become best friends with Shamir. Mm-hmm. And then what else is happening? We're going to the prairies, then we're going to... Are we allowed to even say all the stuff we're doing? South by Southwest. We're going to the UK. So we're going to the prairies, South by Southwest, and the UK. And on tour with Shamir. <laughs> Lucky yeah. us. All right, thank you. Awesome, thanks very much.